what are some of the things that you would recommend in case um, that we can't get the, the rights to a specific song that we want? Um, yes. What are some other things that us well, as young That happens could... to me all the time. I'm working on a TV show now, and you know, a lot of times I'll put a song in, and you know, we'll look and see how much that song may cost. It the cheapest we, I mean, usually it costs like. Gosh, it could cost anywhere from $1,000 to $25,000, you know, and of course even more. But um, usually our budget is more like we get five songs for maybe about $5,000 in there. So, um, so you try to negotiate. A lot of times you can't. And then what happens all the time is, is you either find a song that's less, that kind of has that same tempo, or you work with a composer. And having that song there is really great because that song shows them what you like and what works for your piece and then they can make a song that sounds like that it doesn't have to be a direct ripoff but the idea is, is that that's what you chose and so that's what supports your vision the best so a lot of times well you know most of the time i'll have somebody then compose something that sounds like what i put in if if i don't put anything in the composer, it's very difficult to discuss music, so the composer doesn't have anything for me to base our discussion on. But if I put some music there, it opens up a place for us to discuss what works, what doesn't, you know, why I liked this piece for it. 